here's a blonder tongue cable TV distribution amp that I took out of service from a customer site uh, a few weeks back and uh, it's an amplifier that has, it's actually two amplifiers, it's a forward amplifier that amplifies 50 to uh, 750 I believe megahertz yeah with uh, up to 43 dB of gain and it has a return amplifier over here that will amplify 5 to 30 megahertz to uh, allow for uh, interactive television or cable boxes with uh, DVRs that need to communicate back with head end equipment so it has a return amp from 5 to 30 megahertz and uh, the complaint was primarily of course with the forward uh, this is what a signal looks like and sounds like a clean signal going in picks up the hum and it's got the hum bars and the TV's having trouble coping with it and uh, I'm sure some of you probably already know what it is there's a filter cap there that has failed and just to test I will clip in quick replacement here and then make the permanent repair after that and now I have a good clean uh, signal. My camera's messing up the TV picture a little bit, but uh, we've got a good clean signal coming out. So I'm going to get this uh, replacement capacitor here tacked in, and uh, we'll put this thing back to service. Okay, well here we go. We've got this... Uh, Capacitor replaced in the amp now. This was a kind of a quick uh, repair job. I didn't spend a lot of time trying to make it perfect or anything like that. It's working equipment. It's just going to get pressed back into service soon. So I just snipped the old one out, soldered the new one in, and um, there's a lot of disassembly you got to do if you to get the board out of this. It'll take me, you know, half an hour each way to get. All the screws out, the modules are all attached to the heat sink and everything. And I've done it once before, but just once, not gonna do that again. So I'm just gonna fix these things in a hurry. So we got one amp that's ready to go back into service.